Mali 170 on 120 severe preeclampsia. It was massive edema, of course, and the other symptoms were fully given. So normally, a patient like this, after we must have done the investigations, we have to now to get into management. What would management then, be about? They will look at what the goals. Fortunately, she's not yet convulsing. We should prevent convulsions, first of all. Secondly, we should try to put down that BP to avoid her getting into convulsions. And finally, since she's uh, still 32 weeks, we think we should do, try to prolong the pregnancy, the time to start giving, doing some maturity of her fetal lungs. These are the three goals we we'll, we'll now try to work in those lines. So now look, what do we use for convulsions? What we use for conversion depends on what we use to bring down the blood pressure. Because there are some areas where you don't have some medications. For example, if you, the first line treatment might be if you're using hydralazine, which sometimes the first line treatment in most settings, you can use magnesium sulfate. Or if you're using labetalol, which is a beta block, block I use, you can use magnesium sulfate. But if you don't have that, you might have to use a calcium antagonist in the Philippines. Here you will not be able to use magnesium sulfate. So you might get not to use diazepam to try to calm down the patient and avoid convulsions.